Hey, this is Ryan with PowerCode, and this session is based on the user schedules for the Schedule Live view in PowerCode. So if we go to the Schedule Live view, we can see all of the technicians that are available for today. The question is, how do we create those templates that say these guys are available for today? So if we go to the Install dropdown and then to User Schedules, we can see all the predefined schedules here. And if we click on the menu for each individual technician, we can go in and either edit their schedule or create an override, which would be either extra time off on the schedule or an extra day that they would be available on that schedule. If we're going to create a new schedule, we would select a user out of the dropdown. And in this case, we'll choose Jerry and create a new schedule. And this is the page that shows us the standard weekly schedule. So whatever we set up here will be applied to every Monday and every Tuesday. So let's say that Jerry is available between eight and five, Monday through Friday, and then we'll show how we would give him a day off using the schedule overrides. So what I'm doing here is I'm just clicking on the schedule which creates an item, and then I can stretch out that item by hovering over the bottom of the box here. If at any time I need to delete these or I need to edit these, I can always come back to this page. So here we have Jerry's schedule. He's available eight to five, Monday through Friday, and that'll be reflected on the schedule live view. Once I save that, I can click on the return to schedule page and it'll bring me back here. And I can see that Jerry has been added. And if I hover over his schedule, it's going to tell me what his availability is. Now, a couple weeks pass by and Jerry says, hey, I need to have Friday off. Can you help me out with that? I say, absolutely. So I'll go and edit Jerry's user, create an override. And on this page, it's gonna show me any overrides that are pending, and it'll show me any overrides that have already been processed so that I have a history available to me. If I click on add, it's gonna ask me if I want to give him time off, or if I want to schedule him for more time on. Now in this example, let's say that Jerry says, well, I need off on Friday, but I'd be more than happy to come in on Saturday. So what I'll do is say time off, great. We're gonna start that on Friday and we'll make that at 8 a.m. And we'll say done. And then we're going to do the same thing Friday and we're gonna make that 5 p.m. And we'll say requested time off. And now we've added an override to his schedule. Now, what I want to do is go briefly to the schedule live view. And I want to show if we go to Friday of this, of this week, Jerry's supposed to be on the schedule, but he's completely scheduled as being off, so he doesn't even show up for today. Now, in the same way, if we go back to the schedule for Jerry, we create a new override, we can actually say, hey, Here's his day off, and that's showing on his schedule uh, in this page. And we can go back to the overrides page. Okay, so in the same way, we can schedule time on for Jerry so he's available on Saturday. And we can select Saturday out of the list here and choose 8 a.m. And then we can go and select the end time, which would be 5 p.m. So this is normal availability during the week. Click on Add. And now that override has been added to his schedule and he'll be available to be scheduled for that day. And this concludes our session for user schedules and schedule overrides for the Schedule Live View and PowerCode. Thanks very much and have yourself a great day.